In this Panasheet tutorial, we're going to teach you how to create a mosaic profile. First, we select the mosaic profile tool. Then we select a mosaic profile we want to edit or use as a template for a new profile. First, we'll look at creating a mosaic profile by defining the field of view. For the horizontal field of view, we begin by clicking the lock next to the field of view to enable field of view changes. Then we click and drag the interactive camera to set the desired field of view. Once that's done, we click on this icon to toggle to the vertical field of view and repeat the process to set the desired field of view. To decrease the sensitivity of the interactive camera field of view setting, we can click here to enable fine tuning. After defining the field of view, Panasheet automatically calculates the minimum number of rows and columns needed to capture the mosaic with the selected camera profile, which we will select in the next step. Panasheet will also allow us to increase the number of rows and or columns, but not decrease. Now that the parameters for our mosaic are set, we can set the minimum overlap between images and select the camera and timing profile we wish to associate with this mosaic. To save the mosaic profile we created, we go to the File tab and click Save. In the pop-up window, simply give the profile a name and click Save as New. When making changes to an existing profile, be sure to click Save and not Save as New, or else Panoshoot will create a mosaic profile with identical name. Next, we will look at creating a mosaic profile by defining corners. To use the corners method, we need to use the digital joystick. We enable the digital joystick and then move the panel gear to the upper left corner of the area we wish to photograph. When we reach the desired area, we click the top left button to set the top left boundary of our mosaic. Then we move the panel gear to the bottom right corner. And once we reach this corner, we click the bottom right button to set the coordinates for the bottom right boundary of our mosaic. As you can see, once we set the bottom right corner, Panachute automatically calculates the minimum number of columns and rows needed to photograph the area we defined. To save this mosaic, we simply follow the steps from earlier and assign the mosaic a unique name. Finally, we will look at how to delete mosaic profile. First, we select the profile we wish to delete. Then we go to the File tab and click Delete. When the pop-up appears, select Yes and the mosaic will be deleted. 